Yo, what is up guys, it's your boy Kiman here, back again with another video. And uh, today I'm going to show you my Wii slash GameCube games collection. So, I have quite a few Wii games as well as GameCube. And uh, also, the, uh, some of the games that I have are a part of my childhood. So, yeah. Starting off with Wii Sports. This is my original uh, Wii Sports copy. So as you can see right here. And it's actually a pretty good game. We play. Once again, original. My original copy. I have nothing to say about this game. Um, it's kind of a collection of uh, mini games like um, Pool. Pin pong, pin, ping pong, <laughs> um, and shooting games. We music. Nothing much to say about this one. No one doesn't like it, but I do. Uh, and yeah. Just Dance 4. I played this a lot. I I literally like the uh, music. It's pretty much nostalgia. And yeah. Just Dance 2015. Long time ago. I liked it. Wish... Wish that they could make good Just Dance games, but yeah. Can't beat the classics. New Super Mario Bros. Wii! Yes, um, uh, this was, this was my, uh, uh, introduction to Mario back in the day. I did, in fact, have the, uh, DS version of it. Pretty good. Comes in this really nice red case. Which I like. Super Mario Galaxy. Uh, this one's not my copy. It was actually given to me by a friend. And they let me keep it. Mm. Pretty good to have free stuff. Uh, hold on. Yeah, there's no manual. Sadly, but, and uh, also, um, it doesn't work. When I first got this one, it didn't actually work, but luckily they, they, uh, fixed it. The, uh, gaming store, the used video game store, fixed it, so I might do a, a gameplay of this someday, but... Yeah. Not much to say about that. Mario Party 8. This one is a good one. Oh, silly. Oh. See, there's a disc right there. Pretty good game. Might do um, a live stream of that someday. Mario Party 9. Pretty good. I like how they uh, put the car on there. And uh, takes a long time, but it's good. Oh, and also I found this really funny. Is that down there, there's a little M M Luigi there. <laughs> Out of all of these characters, they have Luigi stuck at the castle. <laughs> oh, how funny is that? Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. This is the Wii Sonic Wii Project entry, and uh, yeah, might do a gameplay of that someday. Sonic and the Secret Rings. This one is a hard one, cause. 
it heavily uses the Wii Remote, and and uh, it will tilt. If you tilt it slightly, it will bash into that jug of water. I I actually hate that level so much, but it's all right. I'll beat it someday in my spare time. Sonic and the Black Knight. I like this one a lot because it has the sword. Yeah. Uh, stuck in that King Arthur level, but I might get back into it someday. I'll get back to it. Sonic Riders Zero Gravity. This one I completed this year, actually. Boy, this game is so hard, but but when you get into that final boss, it's oh, it's awesome. It's it's awesome. It's awesome to beat. It's easy, but it's a bit tricky as well, especially that final boss. Sega Superstars Tennis. This is an entry for the Sonic Wii project because it has Sonic there at the at the front, and it has all the other characters there, all the other so Sega characters, and yeah, Sonic Colors, good one. I love this one. Still need to finish it though. I'm I might do a game live stream and just finish it. Yeah. Next time. But yeah, it's actually pretty good. I like it. I like the original I like the original Sonic Colors one because well, you know, it uh the uh the remake, the Sonic Colors Ultimate, I didn't like at all. Monsters vs. Aliens. I don't know much to say about this one because it's been a while since I played this game. As you can see right here. Um, I was actually a really uh, Monsters vs. Aliens fan, actually. It's, it's quite nostalgic, actually. It's quite nostalgic. Star Wars, The Clone Wars, Lego. Um, this, like I said, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know a lot about this one. Maybe I'll pop it in and do a live stream of it. But yeah, uh, this was this was the um, uh, time back in the day that uh, Lego games were were popular back in my time but yeah that's it for my Wii now let's get on into the GameCube starting off with Super Mario Sunshine so let me finish that Mario Party 7 which is quite good uses the um uh microphone which I bought yeah. Which I bought that. Tetris World! Yeah, I like Tetris now. It's quite funny. Oh. There we go. Yeah, there it is. It's actually good. Um, The graphics look a little bit uh, jinky because it's like uh, 2001 vibes, but I like it. The Simpsons Hit and Run. Um, I got this because I was a fan, because I'm, I'm a fan of The Simpsons, and, yeah. It costs, like, a lot of money, though, but it's, like, costs a lot of money for, for this. Now let's go into Sonic. Sonic Mega Collection. Yeah, this is actually pretty good. I like this one. See right there. 
Um, what I like about it is that is that it has like a movie feature as well as as well as um uh, cartoon art and all that. Might do a gaming live stream of this one. Maybe. It's in the works. Sonic Gems Collection. Uh, just like the Mega Collection, it has uh, some of the games here. Uh, Sonic CD, Sonic the Fighters, and Sonic R. As well as six bonus Game Gear games. Mm. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good entry. Sonic Venture DX Director's Cut. This one is an awesome game. And yeah, pretty good. What I like about it is that um is that Sonic looks cool in its thing. Um remember this Sonic Adventure was uh brought on by the Dreamcast era. And uh, they they remake it, but a lot of people say that this is not a good Sonic Venture remake because uh, it doesn't have like um, uh, features that are blurred and some are not. But I like it. Uh, Jab Master or Nolvin made a um, let's play video on this one. Shout out to you. Sonic Venture 2 Battle. This one is my first ever game, GameCube game for Sonic, and I love it. I simply love it. And yeah. Pretty good game. Sonic Heroes! Yeah, this one is an okay game. Um, I uh, deleted the file and uh, I was trying to, um, uh, and I was trying to replay it for you all for, for that game in live stream, but I just got frustrated by that jungle level. I don't know why. I don't know why some, like, levels in this game are so hard, but, oh well, quite like it. Shadow the Hedgehog, which this game is actually quite fun, actually. Um, solely because there was one scene that, that Shadow realizes that he was an android, and, uh, right at the middle of the end, he would say, I'm Shadow, Shadow the Android. And uh, also E-102 Omega. Funny enough, this, this, uh, this copy has two. My copy of Sonic Shadow the Hedgehog has two. See that? And I thought it was like the, the uh, French version because, because uh, some... Because uh, some of my games that I have have, like, the, um, uh, French manual, because I live in Canada. And they don't. So I have two of them. <laughs> How funny is that? <laughs> anyway. Sonic Riders, which this, this game I don't really like. Um, I beat, I bet. I beat the um, Sonic Riders Zero Gravity, but not this one, which is quite weird. But glad I have it. Someday I will make it. I'll beat it someday. And yeah, that's pretty much about it. That's all of my Wii slash GameCube games collection. So yeah, that's pretty much about it, guys. Thank you, everyone, all so much for watching. Please comment, like us, well, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, as well as TikTok, and uh, have yourself a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year's. And uh, stay tuned for the Sonic Games prod 
or the Sonic Games collection that I'll be doing sometime in the new year. And stay tuned for that, and peace!